Hi, I'm Eric Colburn from ericcolburn.com, and in this AutoCAD Civil 3D for Land Surveyors video, we'll talk about the new AutoCAD Civil 3D 2013 survey hotfix. So it didn't take long for a bug to be found in the uh, survey part of AutoCAD Civil 3D. In this case, I think uh, mostly has to do with survey figures, and Autodesk has a survey hotfix available, and I'll put a link to this page in the video show notes so that you can get to it easily. I'm not going to read that out. That's a long one with a lot of numbers in it. But you can also just go to autodesk.com and then navigate to services and support AutoCAD Civil 3D services and support and you'll be able to find a link to this page for AutoCAD Civil 3D 2013 survey hotfix. So what Autodesk is saying this does is this hotfix resolves an issue with the survey figures property dialog in the lower section of the panel. You can now see the vertex properties for chain type figures. I did look into this a little on a couple of discussion boards and forums and I don't know whether all the issues that people were having there with uh, figures in AutoCAD Civil 3D 2013 uh, fully uh, covered by that statement but I'll have to assume that that's what this hotfix mostly fixes but maybe there are other things in there too so if you've been having troubles working with survey figures this hotfix will probably uh, fix those problems for you. So the first step is to download the file appropriate for your operating system in that either a 32 or 64 bit AECCUI survey dot arc. So that's the file you're going to download. You can see those at the bottom of the page here. There's a 32 bit version and a 64 bit version of this uh, survey file AECCUI survey dot arc. So pick the correct download for your computer and then once that file is downloaded, you can right click on the AECCUI survey.ox file. And then step three is to browse to the installation location of AutoCAD Civil 3D 2013 on your machine. And it says, i.e., that is typically on your hard drive, on the C drive, under program files under a subfolder Autodesk and another subfolder AutoCAD Civil 3D 2013. If you have prior releases of AutoCAD Civil 3D, you may find those folders there too. So navigate to the Civil 3D program file. Uh, depending on how you set up AutoCAD Civil 3D, that could be in another location, I suppose. So you'll have to uh, know where that is and navigate to wherever where it is. But I think uh, for most people, uh, that's an accurate place for you to look for that folder, the AutoCAD Civil 3D 2013 folder. Open that up. And then step four is to right click, select paste in the option to replace the existing AECC UI survey file in this directory. So essentially you'll be overwriting the existing file. And then it, most importantly is to relaunch AutoCAD Civil 3D 2013 and confirm your issue is resolved. Hopefully it is. If you're still having issues with survey figures, then maybe you need to contact Autodesk directly, uh, put in a support request, and see um, if they have something in the works or you're having some other issue. But hopefully this will fix your survey figures issues with AutoCAD Civil 3D. 2013. So this has been Eric Colburn from ericcolburn.com with this AutoCAD Civil 3D for Land Surveyors video letting you know that there's an AutoCAD Civil 3D 2013 survey hotfix available for download. Please if you have any comments leave them below and I invite you to subscribe to my YouTube channel and also to visit ericcolburn.com where you'll find more land surveying and AutoCAD Civil 3D resources. And there you can contact me or visit my Work With Me page for AutoCAD Civil 3D Consulting and Setup Help. Thank you.
work smarter, and be brilliant.